Good job, Lara. Wow. There's so many people. It's so vivid. Woohoo! Look at this cheese. Thank you so much. Thank you. That looks delicious. Welcome back everyone to another video here from Ella. We are on our way now to the Ella train station because today we are taking the train to Kandy. Actually, Mark went there before this morning and tried to reservate some tickets for us, but there weren't any available. So now we have to book a second or third class seat. But more about that soon when we arrive at the railway station. So as you know from the last video, I had food poisoning and now Mark isn't feeling good as well. That is why I am vlogging for now and when he feels better, he's gonna join me. But for now, it's more important to get the train ticket and get to Kandy because the train is gonna take eight hours and we really wanna get a seat. Was, is there a tick, uh, first class ticket to Ella? Uh, to Kandy? No. No? Second? Yeah. With seat or no seat? Open seat. Open seat. You think the train is very crowded? <laughs> very crowded? No. There they are. Let's get onto the very crowded train. Oh, there are already so many people, like it's gonna be very crowded, I think. It'll be a fight to get a seat place. Okay, sweet. Now I got a seat. Oh, I got a seat place. And so our journey begins, Lara. Six more hours to go, or seven more hours to go to Kandy. And we are excited what we will see. I couldn't wait to move at so much. It's all I can do to get away. very difficult to film anything. We can't move to the doors, we can't move to the windows, we actually can't move at all. <laughs> Well, it looks very, still very tropical because we're in Sri Lanka, but very like historical. 
Are you keen to explore candy? So we met someone at the railway station who told us that the situation is so crazy due to the financial situation of Sri Lanka. We highly recommend you to pre-book the tickets even like a month before actually traveling. There is an online booking system and otherwise you can also go to the ticket counter and just book your ticket. Well, it was already a serious hike to get here, but I think we arrived. Say some stay? Yeah. 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 Go Thank you. Okay, we arrived in our room. So the hotel looks good so far. It looks very clean. We have a nice view and AC, which is important. A nice bed, and that is all. All we need. Yeah. All we need. <laughs> We just freshened up, we took a shower which was much needed. The train was crowded and insane, craziness. I think it's probably because of New Year and the full moon, a very big holiday here in Sri Lanka. But for now in Kandy we're gonna explore something we are very excited about because it's a very, very popular temple. Where are we going? We are going to the temple of the Sacred Tooth. We will see whether we can go inside and take you guys along. So let's leave the accommodation and walk through Kandy. What I love about Kandy is that it's a town like between the hills and it kind of feels like Sri Lanka hills, you know, Beverly Hills in America. This is Kandy Hills. The temple of the Sacred Tooth Relic is commonly known as the Glorious Tooth Temple. It is a very important Buddhist temple for many people here in Sri Lanka and it is located right in the royal palace complex of the former kingdom of Kandy. It houses the relic of the Tooth of Buddha, which is why many, many people, foreigners and locals, are visiting the temple every day. Beautiful thing here in Kandy is also the, the lake in the middle of Kandy. I think the temple is right there behind me if you see it on the right side. Whoa! Big fish in the Kandy Lake, Lara. Yeah, so cool. I think you can also take a boat ride here. I've seen someone yesterday, yeah. yeah what right. they're there about, yeah. I think we arrived already. There's a very, very long line of people dressed in white and queuing up to enter. And let's see how many tour guides will already approach okay. us. There's one already no. behind us. No, okay. thank you. I already see that there are two different entrants. One is for the male and one is for females only. What do you mean I have to go separate with Lara? I don't want to go separate. Next to the temple they have all the offerings they're gonna sell to the local people. Ah, there's our Buddhist first temple. tour guide. Remember that you are going to a Buddhist temple, which means you have to cover knees and shoulders. Let's go inside now. You don't need your bag? No, I don't need to go. foreigner you have to take the right path to get your tickets because the tickets for the foreigners are 2,000 rupee and for the locals it's only 60 rupee. Let's go! We got our tickets and worth to mention is you have to have the exact amount otherwise the machine gonna suck your money. Hello boss! Oh, we allow the inside. Allow, no, no problem. Ah, oh, very nice. Thank okay, thank you, sir. So, in order to enter the temple, you have to put up your shoes. You wanna come and steal our shoes? Here they are. Tickets. Tickets. Yeah, I don't know. Tell me, I forgot the tickets at the counter. Wow. There are so many people, it's so vivid, pretty cool. And it's very, very pretty architecture in here. I like it a lot. Wow, there are the offerings that we also did in Japan.
are standing right in front of the Tooth of Buddha and there are so many people making offerings with flowers and they are praying and it's just beautiful to see. Very beautiful. I like Buddhism, religion and architecture. I like it a lot. It's very beautiful. We are really amazed by the beautiful architecture here and that is also something that we noticed that the Buddhists have really really beautiful architecture in their religion. They have beautiful temples, they actually do. Like very very detailed, a lot of gold, it's very beautiful. The museum is very educated about the Buddhism and all the Asian countries. It is included in the ticket price, so definitely check it out if you are here. We learned that the origin of Buddhism lies in India, so that is very interesting. And there are so many more informations that you can get here. Cheese masala dosa. One cheese masala. And one kara dosa. Number 13. Uh, oh, mom's wow. lucky number. Thank you. Oh, wow. that's great. It looks really, really good. Mine arrived first, so we're gonna try it as long as it's hot. So it's kind of like a pancake. And you're supposed to just dip it in the sauces. They're spicy. Inside there, there's potato, there's cheese. Ooh, look at this cheese. Legs dip in the next sauce. Hmm, it's a kind of vegetable sauce. It reminds me a little bit of dal. Very interesting. And then in here we have um, pig meat. No, pig cheese. Pig, pig, chickpea. Pig meat is the app. Hmm, <laughs> this curry sauce. Wow, this is amazing. Thank you. I am very excited to try mine. It has onions and some cheese and I also got three sauces. So let's try it. It's really spicy but it tastes good. Let's try the sauce. Mm, my god. This one really good, huh? This one's really good. Yeah, that's the best sauce. Wow. Lara, you have to try mine. It's with potatoes. potatoes, yeah. And a lot of cheese. Yours is really, really good. Wow. Please comment down below if this is something you commonly eat. This restaurant is packed with local people. Like, a lot of people are here. And this is Indian and Sri Lankan food mix. All vegetarian. It's, uh, it's amazing, actually. All right, this was amazing and delicious. And now after our lunch, we're gonna need something to drink, something to snack. So let's find a juice bar. Uh, Sri Lankan people are so friendly. Big smiles everywhere. So we were just strolling through the streets here of Kandy and we found a local food vendor, a local fruit vendor, right within a local market where they sell everything from fish to fruits to everything. And now we will enjoy a juice or something else, let's see. 
So I ordered two fruit salads. It's like a fruit salad that comes with some ice cream on top. We are very excited to try it. It is 140 per person. Wow, that's a very affordable price and I hope it's good. Thank you so much. Thank you. That looks delicious. Is it yummy? It is yummy, yeah. I feel like sometimes papaya tastes like a little bit like weird, but good and fresh papaya is really delicious and this one is really good. All right, guys, this was our very first impression of Kandi. Actually, we really like Kandi. It's very chaotic and reminds of Colombo a little bit. Mm -hmm. Like it's amount Colombo of people. Yeah. Right? Colombo and pretty, correct. I hope you enjoyed today's episode. It was chaotic, the train ride. Man, I'm so exhausted. I'm gonna nap for a while. And guys, don't forget to subscribe, like, and we're gonna see you in the next episode. Bye bye. 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 Aber ist das 1595? Ist das 15. Jahrhundert? I like. This tastes a bit. Mir wurde auf die Schulter gekackt. Oh nein! I had food poison. Oh. Was ist denn eine Mauer hängen das? Wall? About. Okay, ich spreche doch. Nochmal. Thank you.